We're back with another P.O. box opening, another video, another sweater. This one, it's a snowman, little, little snowy scene, sewed right in there. This is actually a really cute sweater. I'm wearing a Patty's Pub, Patty's Irish Pub. This is from the show Always Sunny in Philadelphia. It's green, it's red, it's holidays. Um, I don't know when this video is coming out. Probably pretty close to Christmas or past Christmas, knowing my posting schedule. So let's open some mail and happy holidays if we're close. That's just hot chocolate. I don't really get hot coffee from Dunkin', so that's just hot chocolate. This one I think, oh cute. I thought I opened this already, but maybe I didn't. Little cactus mask. And is this a sleeping mask? Oh look, it was all bent, but it's two little cactuses hugging. Let a little face mask and put a little filter in it. Thank you. Oh, there's a bunch of notes in here. Okay, it doesn't say who it's from. Enjoy your gift from Tina. Thank you, Tina. This feels like a book, like a big, Thick old book. Oh! Excuse me? It got cut off. Don't you need, don't need your mom to print these for you from Deborah. Your note got cut off. It looks like it says a big fan. You're joking. Best of Mad Libs, this big book. How many Mad Libs are in here? Hundreds? My show, Catching Up with Christine, on my TikTok live show on season two, we were doing Mad Libs. I was having my mom print them out. Um, you know, one was Halloween themed, one was missing a page, whatever. No more! Now we have Mad Libs. I didn't even think to buy a book. I went the cheap route and was like, yeah, we'll just print them off the internet. This is amazing. Hey, Deborah, you're a smart lady. You get me. Thank you so much. We're definitely doing Mad Libs for the rest of time. Thank you. That's a great gift right there. This one I must have opened. Sometimes I just get so anxious in the car that I open stuff. Life is like a cactus full of pricks, but also beautiful. <laughs> Look at that. It's like a little journal to write in. Thank you. I always need new notebooks to write down video ideas in or, you know, skits or comedy. There's no note. Who's it from? No note. Okay. And then this looks like a little cactus pillowcase. Thank you. Yes. I always need journals to write stuff in. Comedy, skits, scripts, whatever. Thank you so much. I just put my cactus comforter on my bed. Now I got a cactus themed bedroom. This is from Jacksonville, Florida. Alexis, Alexa Joseph Candle Company, LLC. It says fragile. So I'm guessing it's a candle. I feel like the holiday that I most associate with candles is Christmas or like Hanukkah. I mean, obviously Hanukkah because they light it, but like Christmas, any of the, any of the truly like cold, cold holidays is what I think of with candles. Oh, it broke. What the heck? It's like a mug candle. Why did it break in the mail? Ugh. why do they do those things? Oh, it smells good. It's a candle in a mug and the post office broke it. On the back it says lazy eyes are cool. What the heck? A little custom candle. It says lazy eyes are cool in the bag. That's awesome. Okay. Now I have shattered glass on my table. Yeah. It's in my arm. It's in my arm. Did I get all of it? Did I get most of it? Okay, there's shattered glass on the table. Be careful. But that's so cool. Lazy eyes are cool in the back. Listen, I don't care if it's broken. I'm gonna leave this candle as is. I don't even care if it broke. I don't care, post office. You've made lazy eyes cool. Your content brings a smile to my face every day and your resurfaced my love of Duncan. Oh, <laughs> I hope <laughs> you use this coffee mug after you burn the candle. Thank you. Um, Allie from Alexa Joseph Candle Company. Listen, I could still use this as a mug even without a handle. I could also use it as a pencil case, whatever. Lazy eyes are cool. Thank you so much for the candle. Woo woo! This is from Jen, South Haven MS. Is that Missouri or is that Mississippi? It's Mississippi, South Haven, Mississippi. M-I-S-S-I-S-S-I-P-P-I. -S 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 Ooh, look at that. Look at that nicely wrapped package. It says thanks. No, thank you. Hey there, I made you this custom pop vinyl figure because I love your content and positivity. Thank you for the content you make. Feel free to take her out of the box for a closer look, but I recommend displaying her in the box and watch out for alloy. Um, I posted the creation video on my TikTok if you want to check it out. I hope you have a blessed week. From Jen, I did see this on TikTok. I did repost it on TikTok. I did a duet. She made me my own pop. <gasps> what the? She made the box too? Oh, uh... Oh, she went all out. What? And Alloy's in there too. What the heck? Absolutely. Okay, she made these pop figures. These are really big now. If you don't know what these are, these are huge. Um, like in mainstream pop culture now. Um, I don't know too much about them, but I've seen people make these. 
I've always wanted like a custom bobblehead of myself or a doll or something like that. This is amazing. This is from her TikTok is Mama Gonna Snap. This is from Jen. I didn't know that she put like me on the box with the advertisement. She gave me a Hawaiian shirt. She has a little alloy there. This is amazing. Even the back is done. I mean, thank you so much, Jen. I know this took a lot of work. I did see it on the TikToks. Thank you for taking the time to make this. I mean, like you painted this whole thing. And I know it must have been hard to paint alloy because he's so small. This is amazing. Thank you so much. I'm going to take a closer look later. But yeah, I will display it in the box. No worries. I'm going to put it on the shelf. Thank you. It's from Send a Little Sparkle, Pittsburgh, Massachusetts. Or Pittsfield. Pittsfield, Massachusetts. Send a Little Sparkle. If this is a glitter bomb, I'm not going to be upset. I'm going to be confused. It says Happy Mail on the outside. My life would suck without you. <laughs> it says on the inside. Look, a cactus pinata. How cute is that? A mini cactus pinata. This is a short story. There's stuff in here. Oh, shut up. I don't want to break this, but I want the candy. Maybe we'll break it for a video. Listen, I was obsessed with pinatas in college. Not obsessed. I had like four or five pinatas over my time in college and we would break them. It would be like the normal pinata, like the classic, like a donk or something like that. Oh, and I would keep the heads and then display them on the wall. And we had a dinosaur. We had, oh, someone gave me a dinosaur for one of my birthdays. Um, I destroyed one for my 21st. We had two, like, uh, uh, donkey head pinatas. I had a bunch. I love pinatas. Thank you. This is so cute. You even filled it. Oh, and a little cactus confetti and a balloon with some stuff in it. I'm sure you dump this in the balloon and blow it up. Whoa. Send a little sparkle. That's right. Send a little pizzazz. Love the packaging. Look at the green and white paper. Love the combo. A little birdie follower, Heather, <laughs> tipped me off that you might enjoy a little party of mine. Inflate the balloon, blow the horn, and party hard from Stephanie from Send a Little Sparkle. Very cute. This is going, you know, I'm not going to break it just yet. Maybe for a special occasion, this is going on the shelf. Thank you, Stephanie. This is awesome. This is from Marla from Oakley, California. Ow, ow, <laughs> the tape stuck to my hand. Just a bunch of wood, just a bunch of wood. Oh, shut up. Ow, ow, the tape, ow, false alarm. The tape stuck to my hand. <laughs> oh, look how cool that is. Alloy with the sunglasses, with the paw, with the verification. What the? That is so cool. Focus on that. Oh, they're so creative. Um, my, when I was younger, some of my mom or my grandma got me into it. We used to take these huge, like a square piece of wood, put nails on the outside, and then you'd wrap yarn, and then you'd sew it, and then you'd cut it, and be like this really, you'd make this really fuzzy pillow cover, and then you would uh, sew it onto a pillow. I'll have to put in a picture or something. That is amazing. And then I just got a piece of wood. Maybe I could do my own. Maybe I could make my own little thing. That is so cool. And she put in little cactus push pins. Oh, amazing. Hi, Christine. Your cactus video is the first video I saw on TikTok. You had me hooked the way you said clover. <laughs> it was so funny. I really enjoyed your videos. Can't wait to see how Alloy's life and family progresses. Your facial expressions and even your lazy eye is so likable. My lazy eye is likable. I like it. You are very talented with your choreographing and the amount of effort you put into your social media presence. <sighs> that is so nice. Thank you. Talented with your choreographing and the amount of effort you put in your social media presence. Listen, I'm trying. I'm really trying on all fronts. Instagram, Snapchat, YouTube, TikTok. I'm trying to make good, decent, consistent content. It is hard. It's harder than I ever thought it would be. Back when I did it, like, just for my friends, it was like, whatever. You don't post a video for a couple days, no one cares. Now that there's, like, so many people watching, so many people that want to see what you do, it's just, it's nuts. And I'm not complaining. It's just, it's, it's just... Like I need to read a book on how to do social media because I feel like I'm failing all the time, but sometimes I feel good. But yeah, I really do try and put a lot of stuff out, a lot of variations of stuff, you know, the newsletter, the talk show, you know, the quarantine bathroom jams where I dance around, you know, I, I try my best. Thank you for noticing. I really hope you become a writer or a star on Saturday Night Live or other formats that will keep your humor and skits going. Thank you. I hope you like this string art I made for you. Do you ever, did you ever do string art as a kid? I never did, but I've done some as an adult now in my fifties. It's fine. It's fine. You can do string art whenever you want. And I can tell like by your youthful, your youthful note, you look too damn good to be 50. And I really like doing it. You inspired me to do this for you and Alloy. Sorry. He is a bit lopsided because I decided to make him a little bigger after the fact. 
and then he became a bit squished on the bottom on the blue by the blue button <laughs> lol be safe and well marla he ain't squished by nothing he looks fabulous i love that Thank you, Marla. This is amazing. I love this. Yeah, never did string art like this, but did make like a pillow or something out of yarn. This is from TS Custom Silver, Happy Texas. You live in Happy Texas? The outside of this card is very cute. Hope you like Alloy the Cactus as a keychain. The keychain is made of 925 sterling silver and copper. Thanks for being the awesome person you are, as well as brightening the days of so many people. There's a lifetime warranty on the keychain. If something ever happens, mail it back and I'll fix it. Stay handy. <laughs> Stay handy. Liz from TikTok. I'm pretty sure I saw this on TikTok that she was making this and this is awesome. Yeah, look at that. Wow, T5 Custom Silver, I think is her company name. I'm gonna put in a picture because it's too small to show. He's like so marbly too. I love that. When I was in high school, I took an art class and we did some sort of like metal, metal making where we did, is the word solder? I think that's the right word, solder? Or like we fired stuff up and put it together. Oh my God, I'm so uneducated, but we like melted metal together and um, adhesed, adhesed it, 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 and stuck the metal together. It was really cool and I sucked at it. This is amazing. The fact that you could even carve out the word alloy, I could never have done that. And he's so shiny. I love that. I don't know if I'll put it on my keys for my keychain because I have so much stuff on there and I always like knock it around, but I might just hang it from my desk so I can look at it all the time. Because this is so cute. Like you hang this part and the alloy just dangles. Very cute. Thank you so much, Liz. Look at this, look at this bad boy. Where are you coming from, sir? Nothing. How do I even open this? It's kind of heavy, has no return address. I think it's from like a, just a shipping place. Cactus glass tumblers. legit glasses glass glasses low cactus these are adorable i got a set of four that is cute what does it say saw these and of course thought you needed them hope they come in one piece they did a lot of stuff never comes in one piece but these did from heather thank you so much heather girl I love these. This is like the real deal glass. Like I would have like a dinner party if I ever got like an apartment, put these out for everybody and be like, y'all already know it's going to be cactus themed. Okay. We got cactus dessert, cactus main course. We're drinking out of cactuses. Sit down, enjoy your meal. I love this. Thank you. Okay. This is equally as heavy. What the heck is this? This is from N. Penault. Stasophie, Quebec, Canada. Stasophie? Stesofi. Is that is that correct? Am I saying that correctly? I don't know. This is a heavy ass package though. A lot of shipping on this. Why are you spending so much money to ship stuff to me? You don't have to do that. Can we move out of the way, guys? Could we just scoot along? This is just a box of goodies from Canada. First of all, boom, right on top. Cactus bag for you. Oh, snacks. We got ketchup chips. We got ketchup chips. They don't sell these in the U.S. anymore. My friend loves these. These are all dressed ruffles. I've had these. They're amazing. Oh, these are all just goodies that we can't even get here. What are these maple leaf cookies? Maple leaf cookies? Oh, of course. What is this? Soda? Crush? Cream soda? Soda mousse. Is this pink soda? I used to stock uh, beverage coolers. I've never seen a pink, a pink crush before unless I wasn't looking hard enough. He got candy in it. Smarties. Oh, Smarties to us are the, the chalky things. These are chocolate, aren't they? Smarties chocolate, coffee crisp, Maynard's wine gummies. Maynard's wine gummies. What the heck? I need these, these Kinder Surprise Balls. I used to have those as a kid. Some Fun Dips. Holla at your girl. Joss Luis. Joss Luis. The original. The original. What are these? Cakes? Little cakes on the back. Oh, it's in, I think it's in French. Is that French? And English. 1932, Joss Louise hit the market and the success of this famous little cake propelled the company to new heights. 1945, Rosa Ann passed on the company to her children filled with local pride. Um, yada, yada, yada. 10 billionth little cake. They sold their 10th billionth little cake in 1983. Is that red velvet cake in there? These are good. Mm. The cake is so soft and moist. A lot of people don't like the word moist, but it feels like it just got baked and they send it to me. This is fresh. Read the note, people. 
Hi, Christine. My name is Nadia. Love it. And I come from Quebec in Canada, more near Montreal. I send you a package with snacks that come from here. I hope you like them. I love them. I love international snacks. I like trying them. Oh, cool. There are some products that you may have already eaten, but surely better. <laughs> Canada always does it better. I love what you do for the video. So fun and entertaining. I wish you lots of success and followers. Thank you. Don't let go. Stay safe. Nadia. Love you. We pronounce penalt is pino. So the things, it said penalt. Where did I read penalt? Pino, she wrote. P.S. You can share with your mother, LOL. I will. Um, P.P.S. Sorry about my English because my first language is French. No worries. And she drew a little alloy. No worries. Your English is just fine. I can barely read English and it's my first language. So <laughs> thank you so much for the treats. I'm going to dive in after I finish this. I'm going to eat myself a maple leaf cookie and then I'm going to probably take a nap because it's a lot of sugar and I'm going to crash.